Apple just released iOS 11 Beta 5 to developers. Here's what's new. So first off, there are a few icon tweaks. The camera app icon has been simplified a bit, and the settings icon has been tweaked to have a darker background, and it stands out a bit more now. In the control center, the music section now has a new animated signal icon. This icon will appear when there are new audio sources, so different AirPlay devices, your AirPods, or other speakers. This will appear, and then you can tap on the icon and be taken directly to the source list so you can change if you'd like. Also in Control Center, when you start a screen recording, the status bar will now turn red instead of the blue that it was before. Now in this version, the iCloud message sync feature that allowed your iMessages to be stored in iCloud has been removed. Apple says it will return in a future update to iOS 11, so it most likely won't be available in the first public version of iOS 11. As far as other fixes and changes, AirPlay crashing some apps while watching videos should be fixed. Also, calendar crashing while dragging items into it should be fixed. Favorites that you added in the health app while running iOS 11 are no longer available, but it has been restored to pre-iOS 11 favorites. And FaceTime Live photos are now enabled by default. But that is what has changed with iOS 11 Beta 5. We're getting closer and closer to the final release in the fall, but it still is a beta and not perfect, so be sure to stay tuned to MacRumors.com for any updates. I want to thank you all so much for watching. I'm Mac Gonzalez with MacRumors, and I'll see you next time.